Hey, what's up guys? Uh, in this video, I just want to go over how to record and upload a 4K video to YouTube step by step. And this is using an iPad Air 4. So the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure your iPad or your camera is uh, horizontal. All right. If it's vertical, it's going to record a short video, but that'll be for something else I'll show you later. Uh, so right now my iPad Air is in uh, 4K 30 frames per second, and that's the speed and uh, the frames that you want to use to upload to YouTube. Uh, so I'm just going to record something real quick. I'm going to hit start. Uh, this is Sonoma. Hello. I'll just record for five for a few more seconds. And then I'm going to stop. All right. So now I have my 4K 30 frames per second video. And if you want to change that, what you have to do if your camera's on a different setting is you have to click on settings and then go down to camera and then here's all the different um, FPS and uh, quality so 4k 30 FPS that's what you want to use for YouTube okay so jumping right into it next thing I want to do is I want to either have the YouTube app which I have on the left side of the screen here or go to youtube.com to upload so I'm going to use the app. You see in the bottom center the plus symbol. All you're going to do is click that plus symbol. There's my photo on the left, my, my video. Click that. Hit start. And then start. I'm going to click this next is so this is so and click upload. Okay, and now you can see on the bottom right under library, it says your videos uh, and then uploading. So it's going to take a few seconds here. Um, these are my other videos, um, as you can see, but this video is quick, it was only 10 seconds. So it's gonna upload pretty quick and then it has to process. And it has to make sure nothing's copywritten or whatnot. Um, you can also, like I said, you can use um, your website if you go to YouTube uh, Studio. And you can also see, see it's automatically uploading right now. Um, so after it uploads, it has to process. The interesting thing is um, if you try to upload at a higher frame per second, like 4K 60 frames per second, YouTube uh, won't like that. Uh, and, and the same thing if you're recording it at 5K. Um, sometimes it won't even process. Um, and it'll take, uh, if not hours, days to upload that video. Uh, but you can see right now it's checking um, to make sure there's no copywritten music or, or, or that you've taken content from another uh, channel. Uh, and, and you can already see, so when I click on it, uh, on the left is the pencil to edit. And look, this is what you want to look for. See how it says quality, uh, video quality, standard HD 4K, and it's blinking. So right now it's, it's uploading the standard. It's going to take you know, a few minutes uh, to, to upload uh, the HD, and then it might even take a few hours for it to be 4K. So once it stops blinking, that means um, that it's completely uploaded. So uh, just to show you how it works. So right now I'm on YouTube studio uh, on uh, .com. I'm not on the app. Usually I'll upload uh, with the app um, because I feel like it's a little quicker. Uh, what you want to make sure is when you upload it, don't just, don't just click the plus. In the beginning, you want to click on the top right. You want to go to settings and you want to make sure under uploads, the upload quality is full quality because it's it, in the standard option, it's going to start at 1080p. So even if you record at 4K, it'll still upload at, at uh, 1080p. So make sure if you're going to use the app to upload, you have to change the video quality uh, to full quality. Okay. So I'm going to go back to the YouTube studio. Uh, so what you can do is you can already edit all of the things right now. I'm just going to name this. Um, let's see how no how to upload 4K to YouTube. And then I'm going to put a little dash step by step. All right, so that's going to be the title. You can put whatever description you want. Uh, uh, and then you also want to put your hashtags and your ads um, if you want to make mentions to something. Uh, Right now, I'm just going to say um, uh, step by step 
information step by step um, information on how to upload at 4k enjoy and then I'm just gonna keep it real simple right now but right now I'm just gonna say 4k uh, hashtag how to hashtag to all right let's do three for now and then put a little smiley face here because why not let's see there you go all right keep it simple so even though I'm not finished yet I'm just gonna click save um, just just so I don't have to do that again um, and then if we look down so it's still in HD a few things first we have um, the thumbnail it's gonna give you three options already one two three but what I did already, and I'll show you in the next video, I'll put a link to it, is how to make a good custom thumbnail, because that's what's going to draw in the crowd, all right? Um, it's very important to have something high quality. Uh, you can upload up to two megabytes. So what I did already is I uh, made a little um, thumbnail uh, right here, and this is only 864 uh, kilobytes, so... I'm going to use that one, which is much cleaner and better. I'll show you in a second which app I use uh, and how to make these. You can make them up to two megabytes. So always try to make your thumbnail two megabytes. Um, so click save. So now that's going to be my thumbnail. Uh, and then the next important thing is we have visibility. It's always going to be private until you change it. Um, so you can do public and just list it right now. Uh, Typically, I'll try to wait until my video is done processing, wait till it's in 4K, and then make it public. Or you can click Schedule. Um, it always puts you on the next day, but if you want to do it today, um, and then choose a time. I feel like popular time is in the morning when people wake up, at, uh, uh, you know, uh, around 8:30 or 9:30, or at nighttime when people are on their phone, maybe like 9:30 p.m. It's typically what I like to upload at. So that way, um, people are in bed or whatnot, just lazy, and they're flipping their phone. That's when they'll see your your thumbnail. So right now, I'm just going to schedule it for tonight at 9:30 p.m. Um, click save again, and then what you can do is you can um, add it to a playlist. I have a few playlists, you know, for my scooter, for my Insta360 camera, and DoorDash, whatnot. Um, you can add it to a playlist. I'm not going to add one now, but you can always create a new one right there. It's really easy. Uh, you want to make sure always that your videos, um, unless they are, they're set. No, it's not made for kids. It's going to make the upload process very uh, much, much quicker. Okay, and don't restrict um, your videos to viewers 18 only and over uh, as well. Um, so right now the visibility is scheduled. Uh, and then once it's, it's um, for end screen, you can only choose an end screen on a video that's longer than a minute. This one was only... Uh, 11 seconds or so um, but with the end screen you can you can put a link to any of your videos or any video on YouTube uh, and I'll show you in a separate video how to link that uh, up uh, it's very easy and then cards is just uh, at any time during the video you can put a little um, a little card basically if you want to make a link to this mid video uh, at any time you want you can choose, um, and then it's going to pop up in the top right corner. Uh, but yeah, so right now it's already uploaded at 4K. Uh, so it's pretty simple. I like to, like I said, I'll, I'll uh, film the things in horizontal, and then I will upload it with uh, the app, with the plus symbol, and then I'll edit everything on YouTube.com. Uh, uh, but really, that's it. So. I'll, uh, I'll put some uh, links to the next videos on how to use the cards, how to use end screens, and also um, how to make a really good two uh, megabyte thumbnail. All right, but uh, give it a shot. Let me know how it works. Uh, if you found this uh, information useful, you can like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, but you can see my videos already done uh, processing. Uh, so yeah, rock and roll, guys. Give it a try. See you later. Bye.